Winter sports are officially getting going. And the NAI's number six team in men's wrestling, the Providence Argos, hosts their first duel of the season tonight against MSU Northern, a big bout early on in this season. It's been a successful start to the season for the Providence Argos men's wrestling team, taking down Clackamas Community College and Eastern Oregon in duels this past weekend. We're on our way to where we want to be. It, it shows that we've covered a lot of ground in the last couple of seasons. It shows that we have a great quality in the room, um, with great quality wrestlers in the room, um, some good athletic, talented young men working hard. Yeah, this last weekend, it was, I saw a lot of competition, a lot of new guys that we haven't had on the team. They stepped up, got some big wins. Um, really competitive team though, really competitive this year. The Argos currently rank sixth in the NAI national poll, as well as being picked preseason to win the Cascade Collegiate Conference. Coming into this new campaign, 12 of the athletes on the roster are ranked in the top 25 of their respective weight classes. One of them is number 12 in class 165, Bridger Hall. I think we can put a lot of guys on the podium at the end of the year. I think we can even uh, give the top two teams life in Grandview who a lot of people think are untouchable. I think we can give them a big run for their money and uh, hopefully knock some of those guys off. The team continues its season tonight in a home duel against the only other collegiate wrestling team in the state, 19th ranked MSU Northern. A duel that Hall says means a lot to Montana. It's a big for Montana. I think it's a matchup that everyone, all wrestlers around the state look forward to. And, um, I look forward to it. I think Northern looks forward to it. I think it's a big thing, especially for the wrestling community here in Montana. While Providence got the better of Northern both times last season, head coach Steve Comex said he expects the Lights to give their best effort in each individual match. I'm expecting a tight duel, and, uh, and it'll show um, us fighting through some adversity. And, and we're not 100% full strength, which means we've got some, have some guys step up for us and, uh, and compete for us well, and I think they will. The duel starts at 6.30 tonight at Providence's McLaughlin Center. In Great Falls, Will Charlton, MTN Sports.